two rows. This is going to be the first tip that I'm going to give you. Okay, so always pay, pay attention to your key slot on the dropship because whatever key slot you have, if, if, if it's a good player that you're coming up against, they might ask you what your key slot was, and you're going to want to know what that is. Because if, if you don't, then you're probably going to get voted out. Okay. In second on why those. If okay, I'll just show you the next jump. And there are always a few people before. You wanna you, you wanna wait for the game to go out. Set someone out during the game. Because if you can, that is, that is big. <sighs> that, that would be big. Sussing someone out and voting someone out. But you don't want to fall through the keys. Remember guys, we are one subscriber away from reaching 25 subs, which is going to be when I'm giving away the first Xbox gift card, and the second one will be at 50, but I, I'm excited to give that away. I, I really am. Okay, so, second. But, um, for vitals. Someone gets killed, you want to look at their heart rates. Because if someone gets killed and someone's heart rate goes up, you know they're the imposter. So it will start going fast like that, like right there. His heart rate just went super high, super hot. Mm -hmm. Purple's heart rate just went super high. But that doesn't mean killing him. That means he's. He's near somebody. Yep. And let's go look at his files. Okay, well we lost that game, but that's alright. Okay, now here's another thing. I, I don't think I really have to say this, but do your tasks. Even if you're dead. You can still win by doing your task. I have, a, I have a task in... I have a task right here. Swipe card. Now, you don't have to always do it like that. You could do you could you can literally do this. You just have to swipe it a couple times like that, super fast and then put it to the very end. And there's another task in here that I have a trick for. Now, when you're doing the telescope task, the closer you get, the faster it will be. I don't know if y'all can hear my game, but I'm right next to it. Yeah. So, that's a good trick. And if you see someone then, your best, your best option is don't run away to the emergency button because they can just vent back there. And so,
So you just want to you just want to start running away this way, and then you sit right here. And if you see him keep following you, keep running. But if you don't see him following you, you just you <laughs> there's not really much you can do except wait or go somewhere else. And here's another trick. You can sit on the camera like that if someone's on cams. If you see the red light blinking, you can sit on the camera like that to act like you're AFK. And then if someone comes to kill you, they wouldn't have seen that the camera was on. If you haven't seen somebody for the entire game, they were probably either in a bit close to it or they were just hiding. Okay, well, <laughs> the imposter left. Okay. Okay, so. There's another one on the skill. Okay, so come in posture. And when you sabotage communications comms, you go over there and you wanna unless you get the ghost comms, you wanna use this and turn it. Just turn it until you hear it more clearly. So you can turn it like this until it's more clear. Or until you see that little red light right there light up. You can see it getting darker or lot and lighter when you have it on there. And also, not even a not even question. When you do kill orbit, make sure the cameras are off. They'll be blinking red. And if you do kill, I recommend not report the body. Because if I get voted off right here, I'm just going to vote green real quick. Because I'm pretty sure if you saw the bullet. I thought if you saw the bullet in this map on free play, you would get voted off. I don't know what that means. I don't know what to do. See the little guns in the front shooting little red arrows. So unless the visual tasks are off, which you never know if they'll be, but unless they're off, you will be clear if you do those. So I recommend do them while someone's watching you instead of doing them without. It. And if you're trying to get someone's attention, you can just move back and forth like this, and they should follow. It. They should follow you on this. They, they, they just want to get their task done. But you can do that and I'll pop for you. Next, there's medbay scan. Now medbay scan is a great way to be clear. Same way, you can also do right here. And if people then, if you then and then come out, then they'll be they'll be running from this way. But if they come out after doing the scan or something, they'll be coming out like this. So just keep that in mind when someone wins. But scan. You can see me doing that. And also the task bar. Now, when the task bar goes up after you've been watching someone do a task for a while, you know it's probably done. And then there's also the upload download tasks that we have in navigation. Now, 
For this task, it takes exactly nine seconds for it to go. So let's count it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven seconds, I guess. Or I'll just count it slowly. And it's a two part task. And the last one that I'm probably going to say in this video is shields. Now I'm going to go get that task real quick. Oh yeah, and the, the only place that you can upload the data that you just downloaded is an admin. So if you've been following somebody and they do a, if, and they do a download in another room and then they do upload in like Reactor, which doesn't even have one, then you know it's them because, come on. And you see this right here. This would probably look like wires, but it's actually not a task. It's just there for show. So if you see somebody faking this task, you know it's them. And another one that I can't do because dummies don't stand on doors, but if you kill someone that's standing on the corner of the door, that's standing like right here, here, or here, you can shut the door and the body won't be able to get reported. And the last one is shields. You can go to shields over here. Shields is right here. It's also a visual task, and you can do it through. The, and you can do it through the. Um, that's not how you want to do it, but you can do it through this fence right here. Instead of having to go here, so that way if you get killed, your body has a higher chance of being reported. There's a lot of tips for this for shields. You can also Try and get your mouse right in the middle. And you can press like two at a time, three at a time, as much as you want at a time. Obviously, I'm a boss, so I can't do that much. Here we go, three. And this is also a visual task. So if you watch down here in the bottom corner, those shield things right there, they light up. So if you see somebody doing shields and you see it light up, then you know they're clear. And I think that's going to be all the tips and tricks for this video. If you found these useful and if you enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on all post notifications, and I'll see you in the next one.